ಅಸ್ತಿಸ್ಯಂ ಋಷಿ ದೇವತಾತ್ಮ ಹಿಮಾಲಯೋ ನಾಮ ನಗಾಧಿರಾಜ ಪೂರ್ವಾಪರೌ ತೋಯ ನಿಧಿ ವಿಕಾಹಿಹ್ಯ ಸ್ಥಿತ ಪೃಥಿವ್ಯ ಇವ ಮಾನದಂಡ ವಿರ್ ಲುಕಿಂಗ್ ಎಟ್ ದಿಚ್ ಲೋಕ ಆ ಸ್ವರ ಓಕೆ ಯಾ ಸ್ವರೇಣ ತಸ್ಯಾಂ ಅಮೃತಸೃತ ಸಂಜಲ್ಪಿ ಅಭಿಜಾತ ವಾಚಿ ಅಪಿ ಅನ್ಯಪುಷ್ಟ ಪ್ರತಿಕೂಲ ಶಬ್ದ ಶಿರೋತು ವಿತಂತ್ರೀ ಇವ ತಾಡ್ಯಮಾನ ಸೊ ಹರ್ ಸ್ವರಂ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಸೆಲ್ಫ್ ಇಸ್ ಸೋ ಬ್ಯೂಟಿಫುಲ್ ದಟ್ ದ ಸೌಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಕೋಯಲ್ ಸೀಮ್ಡ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಎಟ್ ಬೀ ನಾ ಟ್ಯೂನ್ಡ್ ವೆರಿ ರಾಂಗ್ಲಿ ವಿತಂತ್ರೀ ತಾಡ್ಯಮಾನ ಇವ ಆಸ್ ಇಫ್ ಸಮನ್ ವಾಸ್ ಪ್ಲೇಯಿಂಗ್ ಆನ್ ಇಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಇಟ್ ವಾಸ್ ಸೌಂಡಿಂಗ್ ವೆರಿ ಹಾರ್ಶ್ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಹಿ ಮೂವ್ಸ್ ಆನ್ ಟು ಹರ್ ಐಸ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಪ್ರವಾತ ನೀಲೋತ್ಪಲ ನಿರ್ವಿಶೇಷ ನಿರ್ವಿಶೇಷ ಅಧೀರ ವಿಪ್ರೇಕ್ಷಿತ ಆಯತಾಕ್ಷ್ಯ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಕ್ಚುಲಿ ಟೂ ರೀಡಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಆಯತಾಕ್ಷ್ಯ ಅಂಡ್ ಆಯತಾಕ್ಷ್ಯ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಆಯತಾಕ್ಷ್ಯ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಬೆಟರ್ ರೀಡಿಂಗ್ ತಯಾ ಗೃಹೀತನ್ನು ಮೃಗಾಂಗನಾಭ್ಯ ತೋ ಗೃಹೀತ ನು ಮೃಗಾಂಗನಾಭಿ ಮಲ್ಲಿನಾಥ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ದ ತೃತೀಯ ಹಿಯರ್ ಸೊ ಐ ಥಿಂಕ್ ತೃತೀಯ ಇಸ್ ಬೆಟರ್ ತಸ್ಯ ತಯ ಪ್ರವಾತ ನೀಲೋತ್ಪಲ ಪ್ರವಾತ ನೀಲೋತ್ಪಲ ನಿರ್ವಿಶೇಷ ಅಧೀರ ವಿಪ್ರೇಕ್ಷಿತ ಆಯತಾಕ್ಷ್ಯ ತಯ ಮೃಗಾಂಗನಾಭ್ಯ ಗೃಹೀತ ಅಥವಾ ಮೃಗಾಂಗನಾಭಿ ತತಃ ಗೃಹೀತ ಪಾರ್ವತಿ ಸಕಾಶಾತ್ ಗೃಹೀತ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಂಬೈಂಡ್ ವಿತ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಅ ಸಂದೇಹ ಅಲಂಕಾರ ಹಿಯರ್ so he is wondering the, the eyes have uh, are compared to two things one is here it is compared to a nilotpalam which is a blue lotus actually blue lotus neela utpalam uh, it is a variety it seems you know in in the world we may not have seen it but uh, uh, apparently you know periva mahapariva used to say that uh, there is a very specific type of lotus which has blue color it's a very a slight shade of blue mixed with the, you know and the something like a light violet or something like that so neelotpalam is actually uh, some people translate it as uh, uh, lily but then it is a blue lotus and her eyes are compared to the blue lotus neelotpala nirvishesham neelotpala sadrisham tasyaha uh, prekshitam her glances viprekshitam ಅಧೀರ ವಿಪ್ರೇಕ್ಷಿತ ಹರ್ ಗ್ಲಾನ್ಸಸ್ ಆರ್ ವೆರಿ ಮಚ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಅ ನೀಲ ಉತ್ಪಲಂ ಬಟ್ ದ ಐಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದ ಬ್ಲೂ ಲೋಟಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದ ಗ್ಲಾನ್ಸಸ್ ಆರ್ ಯೂಶ್ವಲಿ ಯು ನೋ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಸ್ಟಡಿ ಶಿ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಯಂಗ್ ಗರ್ಲ್ ಶಿ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಮುಗ್ಧಾ ನಾಯಿಕ ಸೊ ಹರ್ ಐಸ್ ವುಡ್ ಬಿ ಅಧೀರ ವಿಪ್ರೇಕ್ಷಿತ ವೈ ಇಸ್ ಮೈ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ವರ್ಕಿಂಗ್ ಒನ್ ಮಿನಿಟ್ okay it's okay so adhira viprekshitam adhira mityukte it is not very strong and it is uh, lajja yuktam asti so hence she would keep switching her eyes from one place to another uh, a young girl would not just look steadily because her her mind is also not uh, 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 proudham enough it is not matured enough for her to just look uh, steadily at something so she has an eyesight a glance which is extremely timid chakita prekshitam kalidasa uses it in mega sandesha also chakita harini prekshane drishtipatah ha when the yaksha describes the uh, yakshi he he would say that i can't i am trying to remember you by looking at the different things in nature and shyamasu angam chakita harini prekshane drishtipatah um vakra chhayam shashini so he is looking at each and every object and saying okay uh, if it is uh, uh, um, the the uh, trembling eyes of the deer remind me of your eyes but then it is still not close to it he would say and here it's a slightly different where he uses that chakitam to uh, um, compare it with a blue lotus which is moving in due to pravata due to uh, uh, wind so pravata sambandhah because of that pravatam because there is a wind there and in a strong wind a blue lotus will uh, uh, will be trembling and her eyesight is also as trembling as that because she doesn't have steady glances she is not a, a proudhanaika here 
ಸೊ ಅಧೀರ ವಿಪ್ರೇಕ್ಷಿತಂ ಪ್ರವಾತ ನೀಲ ಉತ್ಪಲ ಸದೃಶಂ ನಿರ್ವಿಶೇಷಂ ವಿಪ್ರೇಕ್ಷಿತಂ ತಸ್ಯ ದೃಷ್ಟಿ ತಯ ಮೃಗಾಂಗನಾಭ್ಯ ಗೃಹೀತ ಡಿಡ್ ಶಿ ಟೇಕ್ ಇಟ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದ ಫೀಮೇಲ್ ಡಿಯರ್ ಆರ್ ಡಿ ದ ಫೀಮೇಲ್ ಡಿಯರ್ ಟೇಕ್ ಇಟ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಹರ್ ಗೃಹೀತ ಹಿಯರ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಶಿಕ್ಷಿತ ಡಿಡ್ ದ ಫೀಮೇಲ್ ಡಿಯರ್ ಲರ್ನ್ ಇಟ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಹರ್ ಹೌ ಟು ಸಿ ಇನ್ ಅ ವೆರಿ ಅನ್ಸ್ಟಡಿ ಮ್ಯಾನರ್ ಆರ್ ಇನ್ ಅ ಟಿಮಿಡ್ ವೇ ಅಥವಾ ಈಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಶಿ ಹೂ ಪಿಕ್ಡ್ ಇಟ್ ಅಪ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದ ಡಿಯರ್ ಶಿ ಇಸ್ ವಂಡರಿಂಗ್ ಹೂ ಇಸ್ ದ ಆಚಾರ್ಯ ಹಿಯರ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ದ ಟೂ ಆಫ್ ದಮ್ so it is a very clearly it is a sandeha alankara but some say it is an utpreksha alankara some feel it is a uh, sankara of both hmm? we come to that later i think we'll go with the um, the vyakhyanam and things will be more clear kataksham uh, varnayati not exactly the eyes but the kataksham so pravata neelotpala nirvishesham adhira viprekshitam ayatakshya taya mruganganabhyah um, grihitam nu mruganganabhihi tataha grihitam tataha here means parvatyaha from parvati grihitam nu nu iti sandehartakam uh, it's uh, something that the poet is actually wondering who has taken from whom ಸೊ ಪ್ರವಾತ ನೀಲೋತ್ಪಲ ನಿರ್ವಿಶೇಷ ಪ್ರಕೃಷ್ಟ ಅಧಿಕ ವಾತ ಯಸ್ಮಿನ್ ದೇಶೆ ಸಹ ಪ್ರವಾತ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ವೆರಿ ಸ್ಮಾಲ್ ವಿಂಡ್ ಇಟ್ ವೋಂಟ್ ಟ್ರೆಂಬಲ್ ಆಸ್ ಮಚ್ ಐ ಥಿಂಕ್ ದ ಲೋಟಸ್ ವೋಂಟ್ ಮೂವ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಆಸ್ ಮಚ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಇಫ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಲಿಟಲ್ ಬಿಟ್ ಸ್ಟ್ರಾಂಗರ್ ವಿಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ದ ಲೋಟಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಮೂವ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಹಿ ಇಸ್ ಕಂಪೇರಿಂಗ್ ಇಟ್ ವಿತ್ ಸೊ ತತ್ರತ್ಯ ಯಸ್ಮಿನ್ ದೇಶೆ ಸಹ ಪ್ರವಾತ ಪ್ರವಾತ ಯತ್ರ ವಿದ್ಯತೆ ತಸ್ಮಿನ್ ದೇಶೆ ಭವಂ ನೀಲೋತ್ಪಲಂ ಪ್ರವಾತ ನೀಲೋತ್ಪಲ ತತ್ರತ್ಯ ನೀಲೋತ್ಪಲಂ ಪ್ರವಾತೆ ನೀಲೋತ್ಪಲಂ ಹಿ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ಲೇಟ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಓಕೆ ದ ವಿಗ್ರಹ ವಾಕ್ಯ ಸೊ ತೇನ ನಿರ್ವಿಶೇಷ ವಿಶೇಷ ರಹಿತ ಅಥವಾ ಸದೃಶ ನಿರ್ವಿಶೇಷ ವಿಶೇಷ ಇಸ್ ಭೇದ ನಿರ್ವಿಶೇಷ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ಡಿಫರೆನ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಸೆನ್ಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಸಿಮಿಲರ್ ಟು ದಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಅ ಲೋಟಸ್ ಮೂವಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ದ ವಿಂಡ್ ಅಧೀರ ವಿಪ್ರೇಕ್ಷಿತ ಅಧೀರ ಚಪಲಂ ಯತ್ ವಿಪ್ರೇಕ್ಷಿತ ವಿಲೋಕನ ಅನೇನ ನೇತ್ರ ಮೃಗನೇತ್ರ ಸಾದೃಶ್ಯ ಓ ಆಯತಾಕ್ಷ್ಯ ಆಯತೆ ವಿಶಾಲೆ ಅಕ್ಷಿಣಿ ಯಸ ಮೃಗ ಇವ ಅಕ್ಷಿಣಿ ತಸ್ಯ ಇವನ್ ಇನ್ ಲಲಿತಾಸ ನಾಮ ಮೃಗಾಕ್ಷಿ um right there is a nama there so mrigakshi her eyes are very much like that of a deer so anena netrasya mriga netra sadrashyam darshitam tena cha netra swarupa varnanam api kavihi kritavan iti avaseyam so the swarupam viprekshitam means kataksham so it is only the glances so someone might you know uh, raise a doubt saying the the poet has not described her i as such it is only the glance that he has described you should remember right i think in the first beginning itself i said when he is describing the angam he is also describing the action that that anga takes so that is very important in uh, uh, bringing up the rasa Uh, uh, if you are just describing a woman or a man or uh, only his parts and not about what it does to the receiver or what it does to us if that part that karya bhutam is not described then rasa udbhuti hi na bhavati kevalam you are only looking at uh, the vibhava you are not looking at the anubhava part so here it is the i is just the vibhava she has beautiful eyes but she may be sleeping with it that is not going to evoke shringara rasayanas only if there if the glance is described then you can you can decide what rasa it is idi rakta netra then you will think of you know you will be actually be afraid of her at that point of time uh, uh, like when she was probably killing mahishasura so the same i it depends on how you describe the glance and how the receiver takes it so that is important here it is that tremulous you know that uh, that very trembling i that uh, uh, evokes the sense of a mugdha naika in us right and so it will add to the shringara rasa anubhuti later ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಅತ್ರ ಅನೇನ ನೇತ್ರ ಮೃಗನೇತ್ರ ಸಾದೃಶ್ಯಂ ದರ್ಶಿತ 
तेन च नेत्रस्वरूपमपि वर्णितम् आयताक्षी इति नेत्रस्य स्वरूपं वर्णितम् तत् पूर्वं तु प्रवातनीलोत्पलं निर्विशेषम् इति द अनुभव इज आल्सो डिस्क्राइब्ड देयर ओके तया पार्वत्या मृगांगनाभ्यः मृगीभ्यः सकाशात् गृहीतम् स्वीकृतं नु नु शब्दः संशयवाचकः इज डाउटफुल हु हैज टेकन द यू नो हु हैज लर्नड फ्रॉम होम हियर सो मृगांगनाभिः मृगस्त्रीभिः ततः पार्वती सकाशात् आई थिंक इट्स वेरी क्लियर सिंपल लैंग्वेज आर नॉट एक्सप्लेनिंग इट मच सो उभयत्रापि आख्यात उपयोगे इति पञ्चमि आख्यात उपयोगे uh, where there is a, um, a receiving of some learning that is called akhyata upayoga yeah hmm? it's in uh, akhyata pratipadayita tasya upayoge niyama purvakam vidhi uh, vidhya grahana niyama purvaka vidhi yatra vidyate tadrasha grahana uh, so it's a shikshanam it is like upadhyayat adhite that is the example he gives in kashika uh, and in kaumudi also so akhyata upayoge wherever there is a learning that um, that involves a certain niyama certain ritual that she performs so here she if there is a ritual and if that akhyata upayoga is being used here and because of that the panchami is there then that means she spends a lot of time with these female deer and plays with them in the forest or in the garden uh, the yeah forest of himalayas so he she spends a lot of time with them so that is why these have started imitating her eyes or she has started imitating their eyes so it is very difficult to understand who has learned from whom both seem to have a very similar characteristic here hmm? so grihitam swikritam चारु मारुत अवधूयमान चंचल इंदीवर सदृक्षम सदृशम सदृक्षम बोथ आर द सेम मीनिंग कटाक्ष विक्षेपणम किम तया पार्वत्या सो चारु मारुत अवधूयमान चंचल इंदीवर सदृक्षम दिस इज जस्ट पैराफ्रेसिंग दैट प्रवात नीलोत्पल निर्विशेषम ही इज जस्ट गिवन अ ब्यूटीफुल एक्सप्लेनेशन चारु मारुत इट इज नॉट प्रवात इज नॉट अ स्ट्रांग विंड एज काले ट्रांसलेट्स इट He just says charu maruta prakarshaha vataha right prakrishtaha adhikaha but then when he gives an explanation when the vyakhyata gives an explanation he says it's a beautiful wind it is not a strong wind that it is uh, going to make it really fade right charuta charu maruta avadhuyamana indivara sadriksham it is very close to it is very similar to an indivara blue lotus which is chanchala moving because of being uh, 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 you know in a strong wind abadhuyamana is like moving it's being moved by so kataksha vikshepanam taya mrigangana sakashat grihitam did she receive the instruction from the female deer or uta मृगांगनाभि तत्सकाशात् इति इमं विशेषं निपुणतरं निरूपयन्तः अपि इवन दो आई एम ट्राइंग टू डिस्क्राइब दिस प्रोसेस ऑफ यू नो विद्यया विद्या विद्या ग्रहणं एंड आइदर विद पुष्कलेन धनेन वा यू कैन रिसीव इंस्ट्रक्शंस इन मेनी वेज एंड द थर्ड मेथड दैट ही वुड से विद्यया विद्या she also would have given the, you know understand made them understand how to move their eyes and then she has it is as if she has learnt it from them right that is the utpreksha that's why people say it is an utpreksha because it's uh, parvati does not learn that uh, how to see learn the glances from the female deer right it is probably the other way around is what she he says so then it can be classified as uh, utpreksha also so nipunataram nipunataram nirupayantaha api vayam even though i am trying to describe it in a very clever manner but still i don't understand that is that no whether the, the the learning has come from this side or from that side atra adhira prativastutaya प्रवात ग्रहण अधीर प्रतिवस्तुत प्रवात ग्रहण अधीर okay. <clears throat> 
he is using the idea of prati bimbam so prati vastu atra upame upameya pakshe adhiram iti visheshanasya prati vastu taya tatra upamana pakshe nilodpala pakshe pravata grahanam okay atra is that clear i hope that is uh, that's what he liya adane okay so atra adhira prati vastu taya pravata grahanam ayatakshyah varna a ah, sandeha alankarah atra vishayasya sandihyamanatve sandehah when there is a doubt about the vishayam vishayam here is viprekshitam viprekshitam or the iksha katakshasya atra there is a sandehah but uh, um, you cannot take it purely as sandeha visheshana sandeha atra angam hmm. so the vishesh vishe, vishayah here is the uh, viprekshitam visheshanam is your adhiram pravata is not adhiram here pravata is an object adhira is an adhiratvam it is a guna so that part is also he is uh, um sorry sorry uh, sandeha alankara is in the second part ha taya mrigangana bhyah grihitam and then tatah mrigangana bihi grihitam that is the portion that he is saying is sandeha right na alankaram koncham doubtful a irukku i think i would rather take it as just a సందేహ వన్ సందేహం ఇస్ ఇస్ విశేషణ సంశయ అంగత్వం ద్రష్టవ్యం ఐ డోంట్ నో హౌ దట్ వర్క్స్ ఏదా తెలియరుదా సంశయాన హి వితర్కస్య కోటిం ఆరుహ్య తత విభ్రష్ట తత్వం చ అభినివేశదే దిస్ ఇస్ టూ మచ్ ఐ డోంట్ నీడ్ దట్ వితర్క సంశయ ఐ థింక్ ఇట్స్ జస్ట్ హిస్ vyakhyanam there uh, i don't want to go into that okay we'll just take it as sandeha alankaraha here vishayasya sandihya manatve sandeha visheshana sandeha api atra angam visheshana sandeha would mean pravata nilotpalam that's what i feel okay he also says there is another opinion that there is a sankara of both utreksha and uh, sandeha alankara because that grahanam itself ah yeah chalunga le enak and prati vastu vishayathla prati bimba bimba prati bimba bhava han sonna india yes adad bimba prati bimba bhavam nu eduthukudadu it is just a, a, a um, it's like a reflection see in this in this idu paathalna pravata neelodpala nirvishesham atra adhira viprekshitam if if you are comparing the neelodpalam to the viprekshitam then there is this visheshana part adhiram which also has its counterpart here so prativastu you can take it as a counterpart so the pravata is taken as a counterpart to adhira hmm. is it clear that is veru viprekshitam and nilotpalam compare pannama because you are adding this visheshana visheshane hmm. uh, you are saying this guna reflects in the other anamari yes yes uh, so this adhiratvam so if i just had said nilotpalam vipre nilotpala nirvishesham viprekshitam then it is clear you are just comparing two objects but then you are also saying adhira viprekshitam adhira viprekshitam needs a counter part in the nilotpalam that uh, that unsteadiness that is there in her eyes should also be there in the upamana part which is nilotpalam re nilotpalasya tu swabhavikataya tatra chanchalatvam na vidyate pravata there is there should be an influence of the wind for it to have a chanchalatvam okay 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 and even ikku vandu paathomna it is her mugdha naikatvam that is giving her that adhiratvam okay okay thank you yeah pravata neelodpala nirvishesham adhira viprekshitam ayatakshyah taya grihitannu gunagangana abhyah tato grihitamnu mrigangana abhi 
Next is uh, uh, her eyebrows. Tasyaha shalakanjana nirmiteva kantihi bhruvoho anata rekhayoho ya tambikshya leela chatura manangaha svachapa saundarya madam mumocha. Tasyaha bhruvoho kantihi. Again, he is not just describing his eyebrows. There is a kanti, there is a beauty to that, uh, to those eyebrows. So, bruvoho kantihi, the charm uh, that is there, the beauty of her eyebrows, uh, of her brows, anata rekhayoho, the rekha, the lines of that uh, brow, it is as if it is like a, uh, with a pencil if you draw and it is downward. Okay, so it is arching and it is also anata, it is like uh, it has been bent. Anata rekha, it has a, a form which is bent. So, bhruvoho anata rekhayoho bhruvoho kantihi shalaka anjana nirmita iva. It was as if someone took an eyebrow pencil and did it further. So, shalaka anjana, anjana is uh, and the mai, yeah? mm. kajal. So with a, uh, to apply the kajal, you need a shalaka, which is like a small stick. So shalaka agre yathu anjanam vartate tena anjanena nirmita iva sa kantihi. It is not the brows which are like that. It is the uh, luster or the beauty of that, the charmingness that is there in that uh, brows, eyebrow, uh, that it is like it has been written by with a pencil as if it has been written, but it is just a natural thing that she has. Okay. So, tasyaha parvatyaha bhruvoho kantihi ya kantihi sa shalak, uh, uh, shalaka anjana nirmita ya kantihi vartate tam kantim vikshya tam leela chaturam vikshya it is all, it's not just plain drawn with a pencil. It has a leela in it. It is very clever, Chatura. It is very clever in moving its eyes based on Leela. So it also, see, uh, the, the moving of the eyebrows is also another Bru Bangam is a, uh, Anubhava. Again, it's not just the Angam that he is talking about. There is the Anubhava also associated with it. So Leela Chaturam Tam Vikshya. It's capable of playing around with, you know, to give that attitude of the playfulness. So, Leela Chaturam, very clever in playing. Tam Vikshya, Tam Kantim Vikshya. No, Manmatha has a bow in his hand. Swachapa, Saundarya Madam. He thinks his bow is the uh, most beautiful and he has pride in his bow. So, Swachapa, Saundarya Madam, Ahankaram, Anangaha Mumocha. Manmatha just let go of his pride because he saw that her brows are more, eyebrows are more beautiful than the bow that he has in his hand. Huh? Uh, see, bow also has the uh, string in it, right? So the string here is actually the eye, which is like a, a bee. Uh, he will say, he will describe bruo. Bhruvau bhugne kinchit bhuvana bhaya bhanga vyasanini twadiye netrabhyam madhukara ruchibhyam dhritagunam. The, the two eyebrows are like a bow and your eyes are like the madhukara. Okay. So, bhruvau uh, bhugne kinchit bhuvana bhaya bhanga vyasanini. Uh, you are always waiting to remove the bhaya that is there in the samsara bhayam that people have. So, bhuvana bhaya bhanga vyasanini tvadiye netrabhyam madhukara ruchibhyam dhrita gunam. It is like the string, bow string. Dhrita gunam. Dhanur manye sabye itara kara grihitam ratipatehe. Sabye itara kara grihitam ratipatehe. Prakoshte mushtauchas thagayati nigudantaram obe. See, the idea of this the other two lines are if it is a bow with a string, it should be attached, right? But whereas her bows do have a gap in between. If you look at uh, the two eyebrows and the two eyes, there is a gap in between. So, how do you describe that? If you say that it is like uh, uh, Manmatha's bow, ha, Manmatha is holding it. His fingers are in the middle and he is also holding the uh, uh, arrow with his uh, hand on the string. 
ಸೊ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಗ್ಯಾಪ್ ಇನ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ಇಟ್ ಸೀಮ್ಸ್ ಪ್ರಕೋಷ್ಠೆಯ ಮುಷ್ಟ ಉಚ ಸ್ಥಗಯತಿ ನಿಗೂಢ ಅಂತರ ಮುಮೆ ಅದರ್ವೈಸ್ ಹೌ ಕೆನ್ ಯು ಡಿಸ್ಕ್ರೈಬ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಅ ಬೋ ಹಿ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಹೋಲ್ಡಿಂಗ್ ಇಟ್ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ವೈಟ್ ಪೋರ್ಷನ್ ಇಸ್ ಕವರಿಂಗ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಯುವರ್ ದ ಮಿಡಲ್ ಪೋರ್ಷನ್ ಸೊ ದ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ವೆಂಟ್ ಇನ್ ಟು ದಟ್ ಸೊ ಚಾಪ ಸೌಂದರ್ಯ ಮದಂ ಮುಮೋ ಚ ಅನಂಗ ಮನ್ಮಥ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಲೆಟ್ ಗೋ ಆಫ್ ದ ಅಹಂಕಾರ ದ ಪ್ರೈಡ್ ದಟ್ ಹಿ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಇನ್ ಹಿಸ್ ಬೋ ಆಫ್ಟರ್ ಸೀಯಿಂಗ್ ಹರ್ ಐಬ್ರೋಸ್ ಸೊ ಭ್ರುವೌ ವರ್ಣಯತಿ ತಸ್ಯಾ ಪಾರ್ವತ್ಯಾ ಭ್ರುವೋ ಕಾಂತಿ ಅವಾಂಗ್ಮನಸ ಗೋಚರ ಇತಿ ಅತ ಉತ್ಪ್ರೇಕ್ಷತೆ ಶಲಾಕಾ ಅಂಜನ ನಿರ್ಮಿತ ಇವ ಹ್ಮ್ ಯು ಕಾಂಟ್ ಕಂಪೇರ್ ಇಟ್ ಟು ಎನಿಥಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಲೋಕೆ ವಿದ್ಯಮಾನ ಪದಾರ್ಥೇಶ ಸರ್ವೋಪಮಾ ದ್ರವ್ಯ ಏನದು ಸರ್ವೋಪಮಾ ದ್ರವ್ಯ ಇಶ್ ಈಸ್ ಬಿಯಾಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ ಉಪಮಾ ದ್ರವ್ಯ ಅಂಡ್ ಸೊ ಅವಾಂಗ್ ಮನಸ ಗೋಚರಂ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಡಿಫಿಕಲ್ಟ್ ಟು ಡಿಸ್ಕ್ರೈಬ್ ಹರ್ ಐಬ್ರೋಸ್ ತಸ್ಮತ್ ಕಾರಣ ಉತ್ಪ್ರೇಕ್ಷಾತ್ರ ಕ್ರಿಯತೆ ಶಲಾಕ ಅಂಜನ ನಿರ್ಮಿತ ಇವ ಇದು ಶಲಾಕ ಚಿತ್ರಲೇಖನ ಸಾಧನ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಅ ಪೇಂಟ್ ಬ್ರಷ್ ಅವರ್ ಅ ಪೆನ್ಸಿಲ್ ಶಲಾಕ ದಟ್ ಪೆನ್ಸಿಲ್ ಆನ್ ದ ಟಿಪ್ ಆಫ್ ದಟ್ ಪೆನ್ಸಿಲ್ ಈಸ್ ಎನ್ ಅಂಜನಂ ಕಾಜಲ್ ಶಲಾಕ ಅಗ್ರ ಅವಸ್ಥಿತ ಅಂಜನ ಶಲಾಕಾಂಜನ ತೇನ ನಿರ್ಮಿತ ಯು ಕೆನ್ ಕಾಲ್ ಇಟ್ ಎಸ್ ಶಲಾಕಾಂ ಅಂಜನ ಶಲಾಕಾಂಜನ ಯು ಡೋಂಟ್ ನೀಡ್ ಅ ಮಧ್ಯಮ ಪದಲೋಪಿ ಸಮಾಸ ಹಿಯರ್ ಓಕೆ ತೇನ ನಿರ್ಮಿತ ಇವ ಶಲಾಕಾಗ್ರವರ್ತಿ ಹರಿತಾಲ ದ್ರವಾದಿ ಹರಿತಾಲ ಈಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಸಮ್ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಅ ಕಾಜಲ್ ಬಟ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಮೇಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ಎಲ್ಸ್ ಐ ಥಿಂಕ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಕಾಜಲ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಲಿಖಿತ ಹಿ ಚಿತ್ರ ನಿರ್ಮಾತೃ ಜನ ಮನೋ ಅನುಕೂಲ ನಿರ್ಮಾತೃ ಜನ ಮನೋ ಅನುಕೂಲ ಸನ್ನಿವೇಶ ವಿಶೇಷ ಸೌಂದರ್ಯ ಉತ್ಪ್ರೇಕ್ಷ ಫಲ ಇಫ್ ಸಮ್ ಒನ್ ವಾಂಟ್ಸ್ ಟು ಡ್ರಾ ಯುನೋ ಲೈಕ್ ಅ ಮೇಕಪ್ ಆರ್ಟಿಸ್ಟ್ ಇಫ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಯೂಸ್ ಅ ಪೆನ್ಸಿಲ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಡ್ರಾ ಇಟ್ ದೇ ಶುಡ್ ಫೀಲ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಡ್ರಾಯಿಂಗ್ ಇಟ್ ಇನ್ ದಟ್ ಮ್ಯಾನರ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದಿಲ್ ಫೀಲ್ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿ ಯುನೋ ಈವನ್ ಅನ್ ಆರ್ಟಿಸ್ಟ್ ವೆನ್ ದೇ ಡೂ ಮೇಕಪ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಆಲ್ ದಟ್ ದಿಲ್ ಡೂ ಅಂಡ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಯು ನೋ ಫಾರ್ ಫಾರ್ ಅ ಮೋಮೆಂಟ್ ದಿಲ್ ಸ್ಟೆಪ್ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಲುಕ್ ಎಟ್ ದೇರ್ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಷನ್ ದೇ ಲುಕ್ ಎಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಗೋ ಅಂಡ್ ಡೂ ಇಟ್ ದೇ ನೆವರ್ ಈವನ್ ಅ ಪೇಂಟರ್ ಯು ನೋ ಹಿ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಡಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಲುಕ್ ಡೌನ್ ಇನ್ ಟು ಹಿಸ್ ಪೇಂಟಿಂಗ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಕೀಪ್ ಆನ್ ಪೇಂಟಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಹಿಸ್ ಐಡಿಯಾ ಹಿ ವಿಲ್ ಡೂ ಅ ಫ್ಯೂ ಸ್ಟ್ರೋಕ್ಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಲುಕ್ ಎಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಯು ಸೀನ್ ಅ ಪೇಂಟರ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ Uh, i'm not sure if you know about this tota tarani he is a great he makes these big big sets for films and all that but then he came to a school a small uh, 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 kindergarten school and he drew id vinayaka okay with just strokes but then he just quickly did five strokes and then he stood back for a moment and then looked at it and then went back again and did a few strokes it's like that so nirmatra jana mano anukulam bhavati yadyate likitam tatra bhavati tat whoever is being who is the creator it should be according to what is there in his mind tasmat sannivesha vishesha saundaryam utpreksha phalam so this shalakanjana nirmita why is he using that as an utpreksha it is something that everybody does it's it can be a comparison it can just be an upama but here it's the utpreksha is what he what he draws the, the beauty of it is something is the phalam here the beauty of the eyebrows is the phalam utpreksha phalam okay when someone draws there is always a human touch ಪರಂತು ಅತ್ರ ಸ್ವಾಭಾವಿಕ ಸೌಂದರ್ಯ ನಿರ್ಮಾತೃ ಸೌಂದರ್ಯ ಯುರ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಟ್ರೈಂಗ್ ಟು ಪುಟ್ ಇನ್ ದೇರ್ ರೈ ಸೊ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಎನ್ ಉತ್ಪ್ರೇಕ್ಷ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಸ್ವಾಭಾವಿಕ ಸಮಥಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ನ್ಯಾಚುರಲಿ ದೇರ್ ಫಾರ್ ಹರ್ ಐಬ್ರೋಸ್ ಪದನ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ಟ್ರೈಂಗ್ ಟು ಸೇ ದಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಸಮನ್ ಹೂ ಸ್ಟುಡ್ ದೇರ್
సౌందర్యం మనోహారిత్వం తస్మిన్ యహ మద టేక్స్ ఇట్ యాస్ ఆత్మశ్లాఘిత ఆత్మశ్లాఘిత యూ విల్ సీ దిస్ దిస్ పాయింట్ ఇన్ సెకండ్ సర్గ సెకండ్ వేర్ హీ సేస్ కుర్యాం హరస్యాపి పినాక పాణే ధైర్యచ్చతి హీ హ్యాస్ హిస్ బో అండ్ ద ఫైవ్ ఆరోస్ అండ్ హీ సెస్ ఐ విల్ హూమ్ ఎవర్ యూ వాంట్ ఐ విల్ బ్రింగ్ దట్ ఉమెన్ టు యూ you know i'll make her fall in love with you he tells indra in that manner and he says if you want to uh, destroy the tapas of any rishi tell me i will do that kuriyami harasya api pinaka paane he kuriyam harasya api pinaka paane dhairya chuti mai will even make shiva lose his uh, uh, dhairya if you want you know that is the atma shlaghita but then at every point he says it is not because of manmatha that these two joined it is it is to manmathasya garvabangam kartum eva atra parvatyaha jananam asiti iti prathamataya you know if right from the beginning he has been saying that that whatever she does is something beyond uh, manmathas imagination so manmatha should never have had the ahankara in the beginning so atma shlaghita tam mumocha tyaktavan leelaya vilasena chaturam sundarim sundarim kanti right ah okay it is a visheshana for the kanti anena visheshanena gunantara samye satyapi devi bhuvoho ananga chapat vyatirekah pratipaditah ha go see the chapam all said and done it has only two ways to go one is it's going to be straight and then when he just pulls it it is going to take an arch shape that's all there is to it there is no స్వతః లీలా న విద్యతే చాపస్య తస్మాత్ అనంగ చాపాదీ అధిక సౌందర్యం అస్తి భ్రువో యత లీలా చతుర ఇట్ హ్యా ద కాంతి ద బ్యూటీ ఆఫ్ దట్ ఐబ్రోస్ హ్యావ్ ఎ ప్లేఫుల్నెస్ దట్ ఈస్ అబ్సెంట్ ఇన్ మన్మథ బో తరీ వ్యతిరేక అలంకారం ఓకే ఓ దట్ ఈస్ నైస్ గుణాంతర సామ్యే అప్ ఈవెన్ దో ఇట్ ఈస్ సదృశం ఈవెన్ దో ద బో ఆఫ్ అనంగ మన్మథ ఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు ద ఐబ్రోస్ స్టిల్ దెర్ ఈస్ ఎ డిఫరెన్స్ బికాస్ ఆఫ్ దిస్ లీలా చతురం అనేన విశేషేణ విశేషణైన గుణాంతర సామ్యే సత్యపి దేవీ భ్రువోహో అనంగ చాపాత్ వ్యతిరేక అ డిఫరెన్స్ ప్రతిపాదిత తశాకాంజన నిర్మిదేవ కాంతిర్భ్రువో రానత రేఖయో యా తాం వీక్ష్య లీలా చతురాం అనంగ స్వచాప సౌందర్య మదం ముమోచ్ విత్ దిస్ ఓకే